Ambulette drivers and attendants drive vehicles and assist in transporting sick or injured people. Many of these jobs do not come with flashing lights and sirens, however. Often, people who are getting over procedures or need help getting to and from medical care are also taken care of by ambulette drivers and attendants. Along with the kind of license required by the state where you work and the institution or organization that hires you, you might also be required to have a first aid training certificate from the Red Cross. You can also expect to be tested for drug or alcohol use. Five. This is a job that requires physical strength and patience under pressure. I'm sorry? Even though you might need to hurry, you can never rush. The people who do this job well can be a tremendous source of reassurance to people in a high state of anxiety. If you find you love the work, you might decide to seek further training to become an emergency medical technician.